everyone, welcome back to another episode of your daily dose. We're on the Daddy Gold account, trying to get to level 150 so that we can finally get our tier 3, our 13 star heroes ready to go. Um, do we have the food for it? No. Will Chopper eventually get the chop? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I like to keep Chopper, he's pretty versatile. Um, I might just have to build some, you know, 10 stars. Uh, which means we've got to do some saving for some resources and all of the other loveliness that goes along with it. But uh, there is a couple of cool things that have popped up uh, for those that are after the Gwyn. Uh, well, I mean, Gwyn's still available, kind of, etc. But the Gwyn event is ended. Now we have this one. Uh, this will be going live in six days. The pack itself is not parable. I mean, it's not terrible. I was going to say comparable, but it's not It's not bad. You do get like an ultimate selection chest. Um, all of these are available. I don't think Gwyn is going to be available, even though it doesn't say it there. Oh, yes, it is. Momosagi is not there. Uh, it's okay. It's all right. Value-wise, uh, you know what you're getting. Um, and it might actually work out to be beneficial for those that are looking not to whale as hard. Um, maybe saving for the Christmas time event as well. Uh, the only reason I say that is because, I mean, I know it's a Thanksgiving event, so I, I assume there's going to be a Christmas hero at least. I think it's going to be Wano Zoro, Wano Zoro, um, which will be cool, be very, very cool, or something around that is similar. Uh, so in conjunction with that, we're going to skip a little bit over to here. You get the secret diary. So every single day, as long as you log in, as long as you keep smashing uh this one over here this chest doing some additional raids if you have some spare gems basically you're going to be able to grab a free copy a free copy of the new released hero so if you were thinking oh look a hey, free copy that's good i buy the pack that's a six star i do my 300 summons so that's a guaranteed five star then I save up my 80 grand line summon, so that's that's a guaranteed E1. I mean, you're kind of, you're getting there, right? So you've got your, you've got your 11 star at that point, and then with a little bit of RNG, you might be able to get them up to 12 star or 13 star, depending on how good they are. Now, my, my theory is, and for those that are interested as to how to acquire this, basically just do your daily tasks. Do your daily smashes and keep doing your daily treasure chest and you'll get those books. Um, I don't know if they actually appear as a book. Let's try it. Let's, let's do a quick raid. Let's do a quick raid. Do they actually appear as books? Yeah, they do. Okay. So we can guarantee tell you that they are here. Um, I mean, we've got six for 200 gems. So if you do the maths on average, you're probably going to get around that much. Um, either way, you should be able to get the 400 for free. Now, my my guess is my guess is that we've had Big Mum, we've had um, Shira, we've had Oda Hime, we've had Zephyr, we've had who was the other one? I think I, f I feel like I'm forgetting one. We had Goin. Um, all of those were support or damage dealers. We have not had a tank for a very very long time. So for me, I think this guy is going to be a tank. I could be wrong, because tanks are kind of rare, like don't get me wrong, like tanks out of all of them are, are sort of the rarest heroes, when you think about it, there's not a lot of tanks in their lineups, um, so for me, I think it might be a tank, uh, let me know in the comment section down below what you think, now moving into sort of the exciting part of the event, you have John's treasure chest, uh, complete gotcha, like if you want to spend your gold, spend your gold, i.e. your gems, don't, you can't actually spend your gold, as you spent your gems, and you should be able to get uh, a bucket load of these. That's the only thing that I would say is worth spending it for. Um, comparatively speaking, if you think about how much you are spending, um, if you, where is it, where is it? If you were looking at it from a resource perspective, oh, I should probably grab some of these, you know. I should probably grab some of these ones too. I kind of need that. I don't really need a lot of those food types anymore, but anyway, if you look at it from a comparative perspective, uh, 100 gems gets you a guaranteed 300 of these, so, uh, you, you mean, if you're solely doing it to try to collect 
your enhanced training uh just buy the additional pools <laughs> don't gamble it just buy the additional pools now if you are thinking hey maybe i'll get like uh, a couple of extra uh, i don't know gems back not worth it don't do it for the gems the jackpot you only get 50 percent of what the jackpot amount is or 20 percent or 10 percent not worth it in that regard now the jackpot will of course increase all the way up uh, until it gets pulled for the grand prize but the other thing you'd probably think about too is like okay so maybe if i did do like say 100 pulls i get a five star and that's 10,000 gems it's about stock standard so for 10,000 gems you do get some pretty crappy rewards i'm not gonna lie it's pretty crappy in the grand scheme of things i would not say that it, it it's, it's not really worth it but if you were a gambler if you were a gambler you might get lucky there's a huge gap between mine and actually uh, getting lucky on this one. But if you are currently rocking uh, Lin Lin, if you're currently rocking Slim Mama, you might go for this skin. And it's the reason that I say might is, is always I say might because it's so damn expensive trying to get this like a natural way um, to level this up. If I wanted to level this skin up, I actually need the permanent skin copy so level you up i need the permit skin copy and 80 shards to get her up to uh three star i think or four star i can't remember i think it's three star right what level are you on level two yeah three star um uh, before she actually starts to get some buffs to her uh abilities her passes so in saying that is it worth it well we're gonna gamble and have a look to see whether or not we can pull it off now of course you have your customary sign in which is some additional uh coins this this event's going to give you a lot of superior summons save them uh unless you are looking to go for one of the grand prizes um ironically katakura is not up there so for me personally like if he was at 400 i might consider it um maybe consider whaling a little bit to try and get him that way uh, Momo, of course, still there. You could get lucky and pull some copies of her, get some food copies. This resets. We already know that. Now, the superior summons is going to be uh, Old Mate uh, Blackbeard, the champs version of Blackbeard. Grand Line Zoro, we have Sabo, we have Katakuru or Katakare, however you want to call it. Old Mate Kata, and we have Granny. Old Mate Granny Pants old lady granny so she's in there this is probably one of those things where you'd be very tempted to pull for because like Kata is such a strong hero blackbeard is actually really he's really decent too this guy out here mr old teach he's really good in a lot of team situations with his aoe ability um i still build him on Zena account i'm actually going to do a fixer upper video if anyone's interested in that it's going to be a very long one maybe um stream it on buggy's channel if he lets me uh it'll be a very long 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 video um because i need to do a lot of crap on that one but in saying that i have not i've, I've held off building kata because uh for those that don't know um big mama's food is katakuru so for me to build another big mama how many copies of you do I actually have? Oh, I actually have enough to make you into another six star. Um, I don't think I have enough Katakuras though. So I was thinking of building him because I do have some puppets. But how many do I actually realistically have? Oh, one, two. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, maybe it would just be a bit of a food hunt for him at this stage. Like, I don't mind building him all the way up because I will be using him on this team. Um... But, and, and this is where it lies. This is where you, you think to yourself, like, if he had, maybe if he was, like, a reward a little bit, early, like, elsewhere, um, he might be, like, tempting, very tempting to build. Uh, but for this account, I don't know. It's, it's like, mm, I'd have to waste, like, at least 150 to get him guaranteed. And I could just probably save that up for Christmas. I think I'm in Christmas saving mode. I think a lot of players should be in Christmas saving mode because as tempting as some of these heroes are, I feel like, and I'm just going to speculate this because we don't know. We don't know. Actually, he might be a grand reward. Yeah, he's at like $1,000 you're getting guaranteed. <laughs> at Christmas time, he may actually, the, the Wayno countries or it might actually be available and people will be kicking themselves if they don't build him. So... I think we're going to skip that for all intensive purposes. 
We're going to do some summons here. Um, I don't think there's any odds available. Uh, grand prize odds. I don't think there's a grand prize odd, is there? Three champ all heroes bespoke pack, 2.88%. Um, yeah, it doesn't actually tell us where the grand prize are, is for Big Mama skin. Um, if you had 50k gems, you could get her guaranteed. Uh, alternatively, I think there's actually, I should probably look at this. I should look. I kind of ignore this side of things. Is it, is it, where's the pack? Where's the, where's the key pack? Really? They didn't do a key pack this time? Well, that's bizarre. They normally do like a little key summoning pack. Okay, well, the only way to get it is gems. So the, the best value for those that haven't bought them already for the gems is going to be over in the gen top up so hundred dollars will get you 12k gems yes um i don't know about that one I, I feel like that's a bit of a trap all right let's shut up let's do some solo pools or let's see if we can get uh are you lucky man if we get a grand summons prize that's going to be pretty cool i should should probably do this for science though i'm going to stop in a second so for science let's have a look how many of these do i have how many of, where are they? I'm looking for it. I know what I'm looking for. I'll know when I see it. Why is it not under this resource? Interesting. Nope. Gear resource? Nope. Where is this hidden away from? All right. So we've got 14K. Let's just remember that. 14k. So by the end of uh, 10 summons, 10 pulls, I wonder how many we'll have. Was it worth it is the question. I like watching the wheel spin. <laughs> oh, okay. So we, we got a little gem jackpot. Okay, interesting. Okay, nothing there. It says I got a uh, gain five star random shard 50. I must have hit the 50 jackpot. Interesting. Oh, we got the 500. Nice, nice, nice. All right, okay. We got a couple more pulls to do. I really just want Lin Lin. Come on, just give me the Lin Lin and make me a happy man. I, don't, I know it's a lot to ask. I know that it's probably not going to happen, but... If it does happen, that would be amazing. It's a 2% chance to get this. Remember, we start at like 14.2k. Definitely a gotcha. Come on, Lin Lin. Maybe we just like skip the animation. Oh! We skipped the animation. We got the grand prize. Well, look at that. Was it worth 10k worth of gems? Absolutely not. Um, well, apparently, you can get the grand prize a couple of times because it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't. Whatever. Blank out. Do a couple more pulls. I think we got the fifth, like the diamond pack again. Interesting. Last one. And another. Okay, so how many pulls did we do in total? We did 120 pulls. Um, geez, 120 pulls doesn't seem like a lot, right? Ultimately, probably not that much. So including all of the guaranteed reward prizes, I swear there's got to be a way for me to see this. Like, why is there no... There they are. Jeez. So we started at 14K. So let me do the math. 14k now we have 23k so we got maybe with all the guarantees what i want to say like nearly 10k worth of these things for 10k gold well 10k gems more than 10k gems 12k gems i don't know if that's really worth it now arguably we did manage to pull this one so this is like a guaranteed food completion sort of uh deal Yamato's in there, I think uh, Otohime's in there, Dolphamingo's in there, obviously for those going to build those ones. Uh, it is a bit of a gamble though, I will say that. 
<laughs> not the one that I wanted. Imagine if you could have this little trade-in option. I, I would definitely trade that in because I don't need you. I don't need you. I need the other one. Should we go for like, uh, should we do a 10 bomb here? I mean, I'm feeling kind of lucky. We did hit the, the jackpot. Oh, look at that. We managed to pull it off. We got one jackpot after the other today. Eh, not too bad. Not too shabby. Do some solo pulls. Should probably refresh, but I can't be bothered. All right. So, I don't know how I feel about that. I really wanted that damn skin. It's not going to happen, though. <laughs> it's not going to happen. There you go in a nutshell, though. Hope you've enjoyed the video thus far. Let me know in the comment section down below if you managed to get lucky. Are you going to be saving up for the new hero? Are you going to be pulling for Katakura today or Granny Pants uh, if you're building Granny? Outside of that, honestly, I don't know if it'd be really worthwhile. Grand Line Zoro is pretty common to get. Sabo is pretty common to get. Um... I mean, that's just my opinion. You can get a lot of these ones, the other ones for, um, from swaps. Teach is actually the hardest one in my account. I, I can't get a lot of this guy. He's actually the really hard guy to get. Uh, but the rest of them, you know, pretty stock standard. I don't know if it's really worth it. Personally, I think I'm going to be saving up my gems again. Uh, it took, took me about two weeks to get 12k gems, so it's not too bad. So I will be saving that up uh, all the way up through to Christmas trying to save at least 50k on each account because there might be a big event then there might be a big event all right let me know in the comment section down below your thoughts if you'd like to see anything in particular i will be coming back with the free-to-play account doing a bit of power up because we are building kataku on that one we're actually building teach on the zeno account as well um and for those that are interested i will be doing some more dop videos shortly after this one so i'll catch you on those ones Thank you so much. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and notification button. Jump into our Discord and link and field below. I'll try and hunt down those links for the new game. They keep changing it all the time, and it's frustrating. I know I get frustrated. I, I, I ask the guy, Zach, all the time, like, is this the new link? Is this, is this the right one? Anyway, hopefully we can get some clarity on that. Until then, 